morning, ladies and gentlemen. Falsher of Alega Shaw and you. I'm delighted to be with you all here this morning in the beautiful Gale Hall to officially open what is yet another plenary session for the community planning process. On the 4th of June this year, we officially launched this process, and I'm delighted to say, as of today, 1,700 people have been involved in the process thus far. That ranges from members of the public through to the community and voluntary sector, the business sector, and all the statutory agencies who have played their part in ensuring that we've got to where we're at today. Securing such a high level of participa participation in this process is a fantastic achievement for any organisation. And I want to take this opportunity to publicly thank the team at Derry City and Strabane District Council for taking this process forward and could we give them all a huge round of applause at this stage. We have endeavoured to make engagement in this process as robust and transparent as possible by allowing people different forums in which they can make their views known. Obviously, we've had a number of stakeholder engagement processes. Uh, we've had our sectoral working groups, but we've also had uh, social media partners, and we've allowed people to input through the internet directly and indeed direct through to council. And some of the ways in stakeholders have engaged thus far has been very encouraging, to say the least, and it shows, certainly for me as the Mayor of this district, where we are going in terms of ensuring that we can get as much representation from as many of our citizens as possible. Because of the level of engagement, along with our baseline information and the citizen survey findings, we can confidently say that the outcomes that will be presented to each and every one of you here today are a true reflection of our council area's priorities and aspirations. These outcomes have been the result of a huge amount of work from all of our stakeholders, and they represent the level of ambition that we have in our area, and they represent a testament to each and every one who took part in the event so far. Most importantly, these outcomes have been signed off by you through your thematic working groups, and in my opinion, are an accurate reflection of the workshops which you have all attended and generously given up your time for. This process is heavily focused on transparency and meaningful engagement, and we hope that you will agree that we have facilitated the process in that manner. This plan is a plan that has been created by you and for you. It will help to ensure that by working together and by pulling resources, we can improve social, economic and environmental well-being for our citizens and its businesses. Many of the speakers here today, and also those who have provided quotes in the updated booklets that you have received this morning, come from a wide range of sectors with, which further emphasises the collaborative working that has been taking place as a result of this very enthusiastic community plan. This truly is an exciting time for the Derry City and Strabane District area, and I am encouraged to see as many people come together to ensure that we have got to where we are today. Over the course of this morning, you will get the opportunity to hear from a number of speakers on their work to date and the next steps forward for our community plan. We now have a very important job to do in terms of testing the proposed actions within the plan. We will be testing these actions for economic impact. We will be assessing the plan to ensure that, that it will address the inequalities and we will be working to ensure that Derry and Straban maintain strong links from the emerging North Cross West, North West Plan and indeed the Programme for Government. I am also delighted to announce here today that we are officially launching the creation of eight local community planning groups to develop eight local community plans. We want to bring the momentum that has been created as part of this strategic planning process now down to a local level. We want to ensure that there are linkages between the local community plans, this strategic plan, the North West Plan and indeed PFG. It is an ambitious task, no doubt, but it is one that I am very confident that we are capable of achieving. I hope you find today informative and 
if anyone has any comments that has been made thus far, please take advantage of the feedback forms that are on everyone's chairs this morning, and we will endeavour to get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, let me finish by thanking each and every one of you who have taken the time so far out to get us to where we are today, and I hope you appreciate the work that has been done thus far, because I certainly do as the Mayor of the City and District. And if I could just say, I hope you all enjoy this morning's event and, and find it as informative as I'm sure you will. So, Gurumila Mayogov. Thank you.